convincing current practitioners across all fields in healthcare that they need to practice population-based care is a gigantic cultural challenge. We're rolling this boulder uphill, like we are in lots of things in our business. But since we're trained, and speaking for our physicians now, since we're trained one patient, one problem, one at a time, and since we're paid one patient, one problem, one at a time, now we're asking for a complete paradigm shift to go towards a population of patients with diabetes, a population of patients with heart failure. Where's your registry? Are you measuring outcomes? How do you stack up locally, regionally, nationally? Wow, this is asking a lot of people. Now is the time to embrace the population health agenda for all sorts of compelling reasons, in no particular order. Certainly, health reform is all about being paid based, at least in part, on the outcome of your care for a population. So if you would, no outcome, no income. That's a pretty compelling reason. Two, 20 years now of health services research that basically says there's got to be a better way than what we're currently doing. Uh, three, getting rid of the pernicious uh, pay for piecework, private practice, fee for service mentality that's driven us to this precipice and turn that upside down and say, okay, Let's take a different perspective. You're now responsible across different settings for the entire spectrum of care, and we're going to benchmark your outcomes against regional and national goals and pay you accordingly. Not that I believe that there's a pot of money at the end of this uh, ACO-type rainbow, but I do believe in a couple of things. One, there's no new money coming into health care. Uh, two, as a result, we better figure out no outcome, no income, and three, the science of population-based medicine, taking into account all the things we've been chatting about, health policy, quality and safety, health economics, that science, when applied to our practice, will make us more competitive, will reduce waste, will improve outcome, and certainly will advance the health of the population as best as we're able to tell.